Coach, can you first just comment on what the difference was today? Uh, you know, hey, they were good. I'm like, um, uh, everybody here is good. And uh, we, we, sh we couldn't get that, that, uh, that big hit when we, when we needed it. And a couple times we, we got some, a uh, couple things rolling. And then, uh, you know, I told him right before the ninth that, uh, hey, no one here has seen us swing it yet. And uh, let's, let's set a goal to get the tie and run up and up to the plate. And I think we did. And so I goofed up and I should have said second base. And uh, so I'll, I'll think about that next year when we come back. And I'll try to get that right. But uh, our kids, they fought, and uh, they're always going to do that. Uh, uh, I felt uh, a little jittery uh, yesterday. And uh, I can't imagine uh, what it's like for 18 to 22-year-old. Uh, so it's a good run. Can you just say uh, how much it meant this year that the team won 38 games and made it this far? I mean, it's great. We put in a ton of ton of hard work. We did pitchers did a lot of stuff. Our pitching staff was greatly improved from last year. It's a ton of hard work put in, and it feels great. It feels a little bit empty-handed leaving right now, but we worked our butts off, and it feels great. Um, Keith, being here at this, this big national stage, how does it make it? more how do you have more dedication to come back next year you want to be here again it's where everybody wants to be and it's just work your butt off and get here that's all it is uh, coach you kind of touched on it uh, during your comments but you guys got a lot of guys on base but stranded runners and missed out some yeah. opportunities there and, yeah. you know how did, how did that really affect your, your mindset um you know, it, it, I tell you what, and, and how I know, again, I've, I've seen a swing a million times, right, in practice of cages in all our games leading up today. And, and uh, there you could, you could see Co Coach McCain, Coach Deloach, Ford and Barrett, we could sit there and see, and it was like, wow, it's, these are not our hands that are, that are doing it. There's a lot of body going on, and, and that was just from being, being uptight. And so, and, and so anytime you do, uh, again, if you know, there was a period of time where even yesterday going to a two-to-one ball game, uh, uh, it's one nothing us, and, and we can't tack on kind of what Ithaca did to us today. They and so they kind of had that icebreaker yesterday. They went through six innings, couldn't get anything going, and then the worst thing I think that happened to us today was what happened for them yesterday. And all of a sudden, here they go two, then three, and then I was sitting here going, "Oh, this is not good. The, the ice is broken for them." And so I was hoping we, we moved our order around. I'm not real big on that, but we took wall from the six spot, put him up in the uh, the two hole, trying to, we're thinking, hey, we need an icebreaker real quick to get this uh, uh, so we can get on a, get on our roll. And, and we, we just couldn't and, and we struggled. And so it's one of those things I've heard of it uh, that sometimes when you get up here, you can get a little pressing. And I think, and I've seen us do that before. Uh, and I think, and I know that's, that's kind of what we did today. And, uh, but our guys will bounce back and the one, but again, I couldn't be more uh, proud of them even doing that uh we had opportunities yesterday and then even today to to get a little something and, and have something happen and that just goes to the character and fortitude of our players as we sit here at the end of your season talk about your seniors a little bit uh he knows i can't because i'll break down <laughs> that's uh uh Here we go. Yeah, it's not, it's one of those where uh, I'll say this. Uh, I cry each year, uh, one time a year, and it, and it's when we're we're done. And because we lost, uh, you know, I think about uh, you know, Perkins and Edwards and uh, Elmore and all those guys. Keith, what have you learned from the seniors um, in terms of to be able to carry it through into the next couple of years? Learn about how to be a leader, how to be vocal when you need to, be quiet when you don't, lead by example. And they're a great bunch of guys, especially I have a lot of respect for the guys who didn't play, that didn't have a chance to start, didn't get much playing time, because they put in probably the most work. Adam Bice, John Bork, they were in every single game, and they wanted to play, but sometimes it's just not there. 
but they put in the most work. They were the most involved in the team. And it's just, you learn a lot from that. You get a lot of respect for them. Those were the seniors that I was trying to get to. So, thanks. You know, good, good assist. Good assist. As a team, as a team, what would you take from this experience to carry on for next year? Uh, I tell you what, there, there's no doubt, like yesterday, last night, even uh, the coaches and I were talking, and even a few of the players had come to the room, and we were kind of shooting a crud. And, and I was like, hey, we're going to make a run at this this year. But I'm, you know, I'm already thinking of, we're, you know, we're going to get back here next year. And, so, and, it, and it's, it's one of those, and I also know, you know what, it might be 10 years. Uh, that's the game of baseball. And, and, but, but what uh, it has done, I think, for all of us in our program is, is you know when you've never been somewhere before, you 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 know we're all confident and a little cocky, and we think, hey, we can we can do this. And uh, and but now when you, when you get here, hey, this is awesome, great baseball. But there's no doubt we belong and we belonged before. And and I think uh, uh, it will lead to. And, and Keith touched on it in the off season. I think our guys this year are going to work a little bit harder at home in the summer. Lifting, long tossing, weighted balls. Uh, guys swinging the bats. They'll they'll hit the weighted bat program. Boom. I think I think when we come back in our fall and our fall starts, I honestly don't see how we cannot have the best fall uh, uh, we've ever had uh, there. I think it'll be the the, the most upbeat, high tempo. Uh, and so I'm looking forward to that already. And we ride the bus home. We'll have individual meetings uh, about that and be setting up things for next year. And, and I'm already. I could use two or three days off, I think, when we get home. And, and I haven't had one since January 3rd, like you guys probably haven't either. And that includes Saturdays and Sundays. But when, when, when after those three days, uh, I'm, I can't wait to, to get back after it. And, and it's, it's even – you guys are awesome. This, is, uh, this has been one of the greatest periods of, uh, of my life. And, and a lot of that's you all. So I appreciate it.